All issues have been resolved on my end. Four sectors are ready for the final phase. The remaining one is at roughly 70%. Sectors? Their structures are similar to these colonies, so that's what I've been calling them. So we'll have five sectors then? I've chosen not to divide them based on orbital positions. Instead, I've separated them by historical eras. I've been meaning to ask, why don't we create a residential district of the present day? The decision was made to start over, from a time before the world took such a terrible turn. Before the nanomachine incidents? Perhaps humanity tasted the fruit of knowledge too early. When it was being decided how far we should go back, we couldn't come to an agreement. So we ultimately settled on preparing residential districts by era. I've always wanted to live in the 20th century before the war, so this works out perfectly. However, some resources of the era are quite old. Accurately reproducing them might pose a difficulty. I don't think I can do it with confidence. That's fine. As long as our civilization survives, I'll be happy. Once it's completed, just one district will be the size of a city. It'll have a bustling population of 1.2 million people. We have more residential areas than we originally planned. Miss Karabe's hands are going to be awfully full. I'm sure everything will be finished on time. I have to get back to work. Understood. I should head to school. My Yaki Silva Pond's waiting for me. No, wait. That's not the point. Can't lose focus. I need to find Okino. Well, I mean, that is pretty important. I want some Yaki Silva Pond. Ko is so focus mode. I am, dude. I'm trying to, like. Now, follow everything and piece it all together. Now. Where's my lady? No lent in that. We definitely have not. Whoa. Whoa. Huh? Nani? Just another student. But she's so pale and covered in bandages. In the tree shade, she looked more ghost than girl. She's no ghost, but she is hauntingly beautiful. Ayo. As long as I've gotten this close already, maybe. No, 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 no. This is not the time. What? I. Um. Is this cheating? No, of course not. Do. Why would it be? Hoki knows a man anyway. If, hypothetically, I had fallen for him, it was when I believed him to be a girl. Oh, now I remember. He cozied up to that rascal Ogata, too. He even confessed his love. <laughs> Sorry, Okino, but you straight first. It's only fair. Excuse me, miss. Uh, oh. This dude needs to sit down and have a nice long think. <laughs> He is very confused. Oh, my lord. Yeah. He needs to uh, go on a nice long walkabout, as they call it. I know that cat. It's Okino's little friend again. That kitty is so cute. Does it live at the school? Oh, you mean Lucky? Lucky? Oh, you know, because he's a lucky cat. Lucky. What he needs is some yakisoba pond. Many names, it sounds like. What's so lucky about him? You just hang around this cat, and you start finding money everywhere. <gasps> what? Seriously? I mean, it's it's usually like a couple of coins. Oh, so just lose change. Hmm. Well, worth a try. Let's see what's under the box, shall we? Where's the kitty? 
I need a lucky cat in my life. I know, right? Hey, Karabe Kun. Are we on for today? Uh, I got somewhere to be. Oh, it's this. Well, all right. It's that scene. Treasure hunt skill unlocked. <laughs> Thank you, Chrome. Appreciate that, dude. Uh, here, maybe? Oh, here? What box was he talking about? Oh, I missed a box, apparently? Okay. No, the, the boxing didn't have a activatable. This right here? Do I have to do this first? Oh, that's... Yen coin. That's a lucky find. You're inactivatable. You're inactivatable. I have. Is that not enough? 150 yen. Oh, son of a biscuit. Yeah, we're actually treasure hunting right now with Ichiban. This is amazing. more no where you at cat where you at kitty so itchy treasure hunt no Poe uses treasure hunt no damn it no I need a platinum plate Where to go if it's 25 yen? 100 yen. That's a nice. I'm coming, Yakisoba Pan. Crazy. Hey, did you see that guy? He was looking under the vending machines. What do you think he was doing? They saw me. He dropped his change. Are they talking about me? Because that's hilarious. I have your finest yakisoba pond, please. Your finest. Oh my god. Eat it while you can. Sorry for making you wait, yakisoba pond, but it's okay now. Tell okay okay me to dig in. Mm. 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 Delicious. That must be like the most carby. Impossibly delicious. The most carby of snack ever. It it's yakisoba pond. Noodles stir fried in sauce and folded in sweetened bread. I don't trust much in this post war world, but if there's one exception, it's my yakisoba pond. Wow, I wish I had that reaction to food. I know it sounds Does delicious. You know, anywhere is he not at school? I, I definitely want to try that someday. I love bread. I'm a big oh. fan of bread. So, noodles and bread. Isn't that delicious. one of the Sentinel Scout units? Why is this here? This is not good. Okay. And he's... You. You're the one from the shrine. Where we cross time. What's wrong? You can't move? Something's happened. Did Okino get him too? Bum, bum, bum. I should get him back to the hideout. 
<sighs> Don't tell me I'm going to have to carry him. What a hassle. <sighs> what am I, just another one of Okino's cronies? I don't have to run around cleaning up his messes. Stop! Plastic gizmo! What's Sentinel technology doing here? How did you get here? I'll take a look. What is this? What were you thinking, Okino? What's wrong, Takatoshi? What's wrong is this core system. Oh, figured it out, huh? Okino? Professor Shinonome found it. Daimos? Really? Everyone knows that's one of the old kaiju survival sims. Even I played that thing all the time when I was a kid. <laughs> Don't worry about it. You're putting the fate of humankind's last colony in a video game? I'm just reusing the infrastructure. Environment management code. Relax. We're not gonna get kaiju popping up. Still... And hey, faster than building the code base from scratch, right? Come on. You love me, so you can trust me, right? The work's done. We've done all we can for the human race's future. As long as this colony's life support holds out, as long as I've got even a second more, I'd rather spend it with you. Tsukasa, you're right. I'd rather be holding you right now myself. I'll see if I can explain it to Professor Shinobu. Oh, that answers that, doesn't it? Thanks. I love you, Takatoshi. Is that a she? What? No, they're... I think Is they're both this? dudes. Yeah. That wasn't me, was it? But Okino and I were together in love. It's impossible. Again, beat that walkabout, man. Hey, what did you just show me? Put it up again. Here begins my final log. This isn't the same recording. Tsukasa's death. <sighs> The medical bio kits are no good to me now, so I only got an hour or two left. Why did it come to this? It was all a logistical debate over Project Ark, an energy dispute. Then Tsukasa, he argued to cancel the plan, to divert the energy to life support. If that damn Ogata and his cronies hadn't come armed, no. Too late to point fingers now. Izumi-san shot Tsukasa. So I made him pay. Him and his allies. As for the survivors, there's Professor Shinonome and Ida. They made it out safe. And me. Though, I figure I don't have long left. The hangar's blown out. And the colony's in ruins. It won't even take 20 hours. All we've worked for will be gone. I came here so I could protect people. And now I'll die here. With my friend's blood on my hands. If... <laughs> Project Ark actually goes through. If... I actually get to be reborn somehow. I hope I live to protect them. So, hmm. So Ogata and his cronies tried to kill Itchy and his group, and they kind of like almost all killed themselves. I mean that that's there's still a lot of unanswered questions. But that's a big step in the right direction. So it also looks like whatever the impetus was for all of this shit to hit the fan was not an external force. So what I'm trying to say is... So itchy. Yeah. 
thinking that the demos for the enemies. It sounds like that may not be Why do I have what's this going on. In my stomach. Okay, no. Where are you? Hmm. These biometrics unlocked those personal logs. That was this world's Takatuki san. Yeah, I brought him here. Looks like Okino's with him, too. Hmm. Okino! Oh, good. You're safe. Hijiyama-kun? What's wrong? Why are you so worked up? Uh, what? That image. It was definitely Okino. But what even was that? Uh, Something on my face, or...? You didn't go to school today? Oh, yeah. I skipped to do a little time travel. Huh? Wait, don't tell me. Were you out looking for me at school? No, uh... No, really? She is a he- Yes, this is- This is Okino, the dude we just saw. And he is dressed as a lady because he was hiding in a different sector as the daughter of another guy so people couldn't find him. Now, the question would then be, why is he still dressed as a girl? And the, and the answer to that is because he likes it. So, there we are. And now you're all caught up. Well, I'm glad he's safe. Why is that a good thing? He is immersed. Why does That's right. seeing Okino make me feel better? So you're still dressing like that. <sighs> you! Whoa there. You move, I shoot. Bastard must have followed me. You led me right to Okino's doorstep. No. You're here to kill him? Hijiyama-kun, calm down. He's A. Sekigahara. He and I play for the same team. <sighs> Isn't that right? You've done really well holding on like that. I think I know why you're here. You want what only I can give you. You can drop the gun. I won't run anymore. Okino. I need it. Please, help me. Sure. Since you finally asked nicely. You two... Don't tell me. You two are... No, Steady. no, no, no. <laughs> Talk about meds, dude. What if we are? Wow. What does that matter to you? <clears throat> oh, come on. That's where you're going to end it? No, dude. The man is losing his med. Wow. Wow. Right. So many in your endos. Okay. Damn that Okino. How long is he going to toy with me? Then, I'm not thinking straight myself. Okino's a man. Why was I so scared that Sekigahara would steal him? Okay. Noodles. That damn Okino. That was too far for a joke. <sighs> anyway. <laughs> What was going on with those talking images? If I recall, they said something about being reborn? Same here, Ko. How long are you going to toy with us? Oh, I'm not toying with you. Everything here is for real. So the Sentinel's a weapon from the future? It's strange to say, but it does make sense. Mm. After all, even one of its computers was so far beyond what we know. So itchy. Where is Okino? No. Is Code disguised as a man? I am. Oh, hi. You're right on time. Okino. Here's the plan. I need to get some information out of the nurse's office. So I need you to distract the school nurse, Morimura. Just make sure she doesn't get to her office before I'm done. 
Morimura's wearing a big white coat. Can't miss her. All I need is about 10 minutes. Hey! You're a lifesaver. Meow. Yes, I'm actually a cat. That's correct. I actually, to be fair, I'm actually four cats. Um, on top of each other in a in a suit. Oh, that must be her. So, can you take care of that? Yes, ma'am. Well, she uh, she seems like quite a teacher. Oops. I can imagine the boys have a hard time focusing on class. But now that's done. Wait. Yes. Uh, well, uh, there was an accident behind the school. A student's been injured. Oh, no. Can you help me get them to the nurse's office? Uh, well, actually, they can't move because they broke their leg. Oh, that's awful. We'll have to call them an ambulance quick. Wait, I mean, their leg's mostly fine, actually. They scraped their arm. Well, their entire body. They're very scraped. Hmm. Maybe you should come and see for yourself. You don't even go to this school, do you? I know that uniform. You're from Nigakuri High, aren't you? Are you trying to pull pranks on teachers? The jig is up. <laughs> Smooth. What year are you? Tell me your name. You're coming with me to the student guidance room. Who's your homeroom teacher? What year? Tell me. No. Just kidding. No. Retreat. No. Sovex, down boy, down. I need more soda. More soda is required. I'm just gonna follow this cat around and get rich. That's a lot. My life. I have your finest. Sorry for. Mm. Okay. Maybe our buddy's done. Hopefully he is. This place always helps me relax. Some kind of nostalgia. The building still smells like it did back then. Hmm. I wonder if things turned up. I thought he'd come. Suppose I can wait a bit longer. Okay. I wonder if I thought he'd come. Suppose I can wait a. Back then, I was just focused on training to pilot the Sentinel. I never imagined I'd end up like this. Oh, here we go. Oh, we're 
we're doing this. What's wrong? You can take a closer look. think I remember my first time seeing it too the thrill of it all left me speechless so this is the sentinel that's right look at those arms those legs it's like an iron giant a 2,000 ton invincible iron giant at that You see those batteries on the front? Like a battleships? I don't know much about the technical side, but it uses an electromagnetic field instead of gunpowder. One ton of shells in a single salvo. A ton? Jeez, they're just like the main batteries on the Nagato. And those new flying bombs equipped on its back? They control their own path. Never miss a mark. How is that possible? It will revolutionize war as we know it. If all that's true, then it sounds like a gift from the gods, or something out of a science fiction novel. Oh, Professor oh. Doji can tell you the specifics. Now, apparently, it's based on this technology out of Germany. Do, do, do. Take out of Germany? And I suggest you leave the details what? to the what? engineers. All we need to do is strap in and protect our homeland. And if I'm not able to, that duty will fall to you. Aren't there any better candidates among the adults? Why did they turn to students like us? The Sentinel's no ordinary machine. It chooses its pilots. You and I were, apparently, the only viable choices. Hey, you two. Huh? Kiriko-san! Why are you here? This area should be highly restricted. Oh, you know, I'm just delivering documents on the professor's behalf. It's fine, Kitaro. She's the professor's daughter. I have permission. Come with me. We'd better start on your sync connection adjustments. Well, the professor wants to anyway. I'm just the messenger. <sighs> Thank you for passing that along, Kiriko-san. Let's go, Kitaro. Calm down, chat. Since I never went Calm back, down. Kitaro should have been made the only Sentinel pilot. But nothing in the history books even mentions him. Maybe they couldn't get the Sentinel ready in time. <sighs> oh, hi. Oh, hi, oh! It can't be. It is! If it isn't Kitaro! In the flesh! Who are you? Do I look that different? It's me, Hijiyama. I never imagined you'd wind up here too. Takatoshi-san? Uh, XX Pop. No idea. I haven't played the other ones. <sighs> SFL Bill. Nani! It's the hair, isn't it? Hey, Modern Poet. I suppose I can't blame you for not recognizing me. I've been living here for half a year now myself. It's yeah, time to grow. Take a closer look. I swear, it's me. It really is you, Takatoshi-san. What happened to the Sentinel? Well, that's actually how I came to this era. What, through the Sentinel? It has the capacity to time travel. Uh, what? So it's true. It really is a weapon from the future. Where is the Sentinel? Somewhere nearby? It is around here, but I can't move it. Shikishima and the Sarah's government caught wind of it too. They've seized the Sentinel. Dear gods. Are you hungry at all? Come see where I'm staying. I'll treat you to some yakisoba pon. Oh no, I'm fine. These days, I'm in the care of Karabe's grandchild. I see. 
But I'm telling you, you've got to try this yakisoba pan. It's the most delicious food this era has to offer. Takatoshi-san, have you had the chance to try any... Hamburger? What is this... Hamburger? I have reason to believe it's the greatest culinary invention in history. You overestimate your burger, my friend. Okino said he didn't want anyone knowing he was here. Best not to go talking about Kiriko Doji either. Dude, that line was amazing. So this is why you disappeared. You came here. What happened after I left? You escaped as an accomplice to Kiriko Doji. At least, that's what all the reports said. Nothing doing! Do you think I'm a spy as well? No chance of that. But, even if you were a spy, you wouldn't face any punishment for it. What do you mean by that? There's nobody left in our time to authorize it. So, we lost the war. Just like in the history books. It's nothing to do with the war. The monsters destroyed everything. What, what do you mean? Explain yourself. <laughs> this game is sponsored by Yakisobopan. Delicious fried noodles. Hold it, Okino. An amazing sauce. Okay, Taro was bread. talking about some horde of monsters. I want a real explanation. Hey! This place. I think it'd be better to show you, instead of trying to explain. So if we go back to the 1940s... So it's true. This shrine held a way to travel across time. You're coming, right? Of course. Then let's get going. Why does it keep showing this? That this was the biggest troll in this game. There's no clock going back. If no. We here, it's the same thing. Tamalsan's house should have been around here. Not that you can tell with it like this. It's just like Keitaro said. There's not a soul in the factory or the bunker. Doesn't look like there's anyone around here either. You'd think this place was hit by one of the air raids, but there isn't even a single body. No sign of any international aid or intervention? Because Japan wasn't the only one hit. If I had to guess, this is the state of the entire world. What? What are those? Wait, they're just chilling? Then? The ones you've been talking about? Yeah, they're all Daimos. Destroyers of worlds. Some of them are the size of the Sentinels. And those aren't even the biggest. What you're seeing is just a fraction of their forces. A unit of hundreds has already passed through here. Did these monsters... Eat everyone? They don't eat. The people have all been captured. Thanks to a buried UFO. Well, a saucer. A saucer? That's what the Daimos are after. Their goal is to break through to that giant underground saucer. Specifically to get in contact with its tech. That triggers the saucer's shifter, which teleports civilians. As to where they go, or why the Daimos do it, we don't know. So my mother... And to Mausan, these things took them away? Wait, if the world was destroyed in the 1940s, then the land in 1985 should be... It's hitting you too, huh? Does that mean these are parallel worlds? I'm impressed you even know the concept. You used to borrow Keitaro science fiction novels. At the very least, there's one thing we know for sure. This reality and the other aren't oh. connected by causality. Real quick, just because I'm seeing the discussion in chat. Um, no, the 
Okino is not, he's not trans. Trans means you are switching genders. Like you're who you are. Okino is a dude that we think is gay that likes dressing up as a woman at times. That's all. <laughs> yeah, so it's, it's a little different. He's, he's a, he's a cross-dressing gay dude. Yeah. But no, he, the, the pat, the, the, the real him, I guess we call him, um, just wore normal clothes as a dude and he was in a relationship with this guy in the past future thing. Yeah. No, trans means you're actually like transitioning your identity, which he is not doing. He is not, he is not doing that. Yeah. That's different. Nothing makes sense anymore. If this is a nightmare, I want to wake up. Just looking at this, it doesn't feel real. Yeah, maybe it doesn't. <laughs> Mods going him. Yeah, guys, tra trap is not a good term. That's that's not a that's not a good term. 